Alrighty guys, here we go! Thanks for coming up. Just wanted to give you a quick update on how things are progressing. I talked to Coach and uh -oh. he agrees. You've been playing well lately. He thinks you're close to being ready for the starting lineup. I'm definitely ready. <laughs> I want to say it's about time, but that's really bogus. So yeah, we'll so stick with I. this. I mean, I, I've been working hard lately, you know. Uh, I, I'm ready to take that next step. But real talk, I mean, I just want to help this team win games, whether that's starting lineup or coming off the bench. Good. Sounds like you have your head straight on about this. No need to rush things, right? You're young, and being a starter in the NBA, that carries a lot of responsibility. We just don't want to make a move until we're sure it's the right thing to do. Oh, I, I completely understand. I mean, I'm ready to do whatever coach needs me to do. You know? Excellent. How many points do you need me to well, score before you know? What you're doing and <laughs> I'll let you know if anything changes. <laughs> Oh, this is the most ridiculous thing in the world. Uh, we just had a game-winning yeah, shot. We're dropping like 35-plus points a game for five games in a row, and we're still not a starter. Oh, my God. Absolutely ridiculous. Looks like we're heading to Washington to take on the Wizards. Here we go. Greetings, passengers. Let's see what uh, social media has to say. Area. Martin named NBA us. Player of the Week, of course. The uh... Durant and Martin also named players. Oh, I guess that's the same same thing. Okay. Uh, Al Harrington has a challenge. I know you like to drop him from deep, but I'm shutting you down tonight. I think you can knock down three threes on me, of course. Got this quote from Trevor Fon, the Pistons 3.1 over the Magic. We just want to make him think they had a chance. Yo, we got to get Trevor in the starting lineup. Dude's ready. Have y'all seen the way he's playing lately? Come on, Pistons, make it happen. Uh, Trevor must have felt good dropping every one of those 37 points. You guys like making us nervous, don't you? Kept waiting on them for that dagger from the magic and it never came. Thank goodness. Uh, all right, cool. So people are happy. We're getting close to becoming a starter. Josh Smith still has those super creepy eyes. And uh-oh, on the plane. Oh yeah, yeah. What's up? Need something? Listen, hey, I just want to get out in the open. You've been balling lately, and it's probably only a matter of time before you're starting instead of. Oh man, that's sad. Um, <laughs> I don't know about definitely that. Definitely going to be humble here. I'm just trying to help this team win games. The rest of that stuff is up to coach. Glad to hear you putting the team first. A lot of young players aren't willing or able to do that. And hey, no hard feelings on my side either way. You get my spot, it'll be because you earned it. I appreciate it. hearing that from you. But hey, let's just get these W's, all right? For sure, man, for sure. Oh, that makes me really sad. <laughs> He's gonna be our uh, our agent. He's gonna be. Oh, you the man lately. Keep up the good work out there, <laughs> man. I really like what I'm seeing lately. I see number big things ahead for you. You are the man. Thanks, bro. I haven't heard that six times already. <laughs> oh my god, but that makes me feel really bad. <clears throat> I didn't really think of it from that perspective. You know, we aren't just not starting ourselves, but we're gonna be taking somebody's starting spot. It's their livelihood, man. That sucks. Oh well, gotta do what you gotta do. I'd be pissed if somebody took my starting spot. There'd definitely be a lot of hard feelings. Not gonna lie. But, oh well. Let's worry about these wizards, baby. Let's get another W. Let's drop another 30 plus points. Let's make it pretty obvious to coach that it's time for us to start. Here we go. And the players getting together for a little chat as we're just about ready to get going here. It's the Eastern Conference on display featuring the Detroit Pistons. Here we go, baby. everyone from all of us at 2K Sports. And do we have a present for you today? For Steve Kerr and Clark Kelly. Let's make some noise. I'm ready to get this on. Oh, everybody do the John. Wow, John. Wow. All right. A minus perimeter defense, F post defense, C plus inside scoring, B outside scoring. Wow, they did him pretty bogus. I figured he'd have better stats than that. Here's Martin. He's coming off a 37. I really want to start passing the ball to Stucky now because I want him to do well. Look at that. John Wall getting shit on. Oh, my God. 
was in Detroit where they were unable to fight off the Pistons. Yeah, that was just me. It was about as shaky as it could be. At home, you know, that kind of defense isn't going to cut it. Never mind if you're on the road. Or was Wall guarding us? I'm not sure. I think he was. I wasn't really paying attention. But whoever whoever was guarding us, they just got shit on. Too late, but something was amiss because they had no energy well probably the right play defensively if you can't get the block send them to the free throw line don't get nice. them an easy two no easy buckets inside force free throws and work to keep them out look at that pass beautiful you know adding an outside shot is going to be the key to whether john wall is a good player or a great one he's shown he has the speed but until he can force defenders to respect that outside shot. Come on, pass it over here, John. Just gonna back off of and now Doris Burke has an update from the sidelines. Well, guys, over that last break, I oh, give me that rebound. Oh! How do we not get that rebound? A loud man to score. Come on now. That was not my man. That was anybody's man. Yep, John Wall's guarding us. Ooh, good box out, bro. Some easy looks. It's still very early in this game, so there's plenty of time for those changes to take effect, Kevin. Thanks again, Doris. And Wall, a good free throw shooter, over 80% from the line last season. So, Clark, it's not like the form on his shot is broken at all. No, it's um, got some issues, though. Yes, it does. And it's going to be a matter of practice, Kevin. Before Let's go. The NBA was so much more explosive. Got him! That Coach Carter shot, son. That is our specialty. Balance and consistency with those mechanics on his shot. So for Washington, their last game a loss to the Timberwolves in Minnesota. Yeah, they really struggled to put points on the board throughout that game, guys. And in terms of their offense, nothing seemed to go right. And once they started, get the ball back here. It's a tie them. game. Let's see if we can there make something no happen. Out of it, Steve. Um, their scoring just went dry. And the Pistons making a change here. What the fudge is going on? <laughs> They're all just chilling there. One thirty-one left in the first quarter. This is the Monroe. I see you, Greg. Oh, wide Here's open to Tome. Knocks it down, of course. Quick possession right there. Boy, has there been any defense played yet in this game? Nope. This game has been all about rapid fire offense early. And Temple kicks to Seraphin. Probably should have switched there. Pope loose. Oh. Unloads from 13. Damn it. We should have had that. Seraphins got it all tied up now for the Wizards. So for the Pistons, their last game, a win against the Magic in Orlando. Ooh, and they did could have drove there. Have to do as a road team. Knock that down, Atome. Oh, oh. Like wide open down they low. Took a punch, they had a counter. You'll like this, Steve. Reverse spurtability, we call that. <laughs> they had any defensive lapses, they immediately Woo! made up. Almost had a swat there. Off. I wanted it. Know each other well, clearly, because that was a beautiful pass. Outside, Mark. Getting it down to Greg. Nice. Monroe's got his second basket. Fortunately, didn't get the assist for that. Dominant in the low post. You just can't let him get the ball in there so tight. Too easy. It was really simple for him to go to work there. Temple, the best. Got him. Oh, there's our uh, interceptor at work. Unfortunately, we didn't grab it. The entire defense was frozen foot. Nobody picked up the shooter, Kevin. 15 seconds. Give him the ball. Here is Bynum. Quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. Pick and roll. Martin with it. From deep three point range. Got him! <laughs> that deep three, son. Wide open. Had to take it. And at the end of one, both teams putting up some points. Pistons. We're 100% from the floor, aren't we, so far? A couple of threes. Uh oh, January 1st, New Year. Evan Turner and the Sixers. Sixers. Take on Ty Lawson and the Denver Nuggets. And the Nuggets. Ten. Shoot, I thought that was going to be our game. All right, here we go. Coming in, going against Glenn Rice Jr. C inside scoring, B outside scoring, C plus perimeter defense, D post defense. So this is going to be an easy matchup. This guy's got nothing on us. Wizards have gone 4 of 8 so far here in the second quarter. Detroit really is one of the younger teams in the league as far as their core and future are concerned. Ooh, shit, 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 nice shit, 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 shit. think what might they become going forward. But they are going to struggle at times, especially on the road. We've got Wall. What you got, John? Trevor nice. Ariza out there with Trevor Booker. 
Then it's Kevin Serafin, and it's Rice in at the two spot. You gotta it's guard me, son. Oh, what? I think we we're a little bit off balance, and we were losing, or we're missing from some stamina. That stinks, though. One of the reasons why the fans were a bit frustrated with how the team developed over the course of last year. Trying to get this ball, trying to poke it out. Ooh, good pass. Yeah, that's right, Kevin. Just 11 and 30 away from the palace. And you know, when you're a young team, it, it takes a lot of mental toughness and growth. All right, here we go. Greg, I see you, bro. Hell yeah. They're still learning. Good on the shot. Monroe's got the lead up to six now for the Pistons. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with the way they work down low. Well, it's become one of the stories of the first half, Mark. Just piling up points in the paint. Oh, I want that read. Things have kind of gone south. But I hit a Coach Carter. Nope. Here's Martin. Unreal. Look at those moves, son. You know, something that I've seen and that I've noticed is how well he reads. In Slightly early. Eyes. He just seems to anticipate exactly where he's going to go with the ball. That's a good observation. Excellent release. You, Steve, and that's exactly oh, yeah. why so many of his steals come from picking off passes. He really thinks the game out and usually stays one step ahead. And the Pistons making a change here. Harrelson's checked in. Outside wall. He kicks it to Harrington. The shot. Got him. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Short stroke. Uh, oh, shit. <laughs> I was going to pass it to somebody. That was my goal, but nobody cut to the basket. So I was like, all right. We'll keep the fast break alive, and I'll just take a shot. But Wall just shat on me. Now, here's Ariza. He's guarded closely, and he gets it to go. Nothing I could do there. I was stopping Wall. Had to come off my man. We're cool. We're all good. I see you down there, Greg. Martin, the best to Detome. Monroe down low. Harrington on him. Monroe dishes to Martin. Six to shoot. A baseline drive, son. Oh, nice. Good shot. Okay, wow, we've been a little bit, uh, a little bit off here. Got a great read of where that miss was going, and that allowed him to be the first. No, we had him double teamed. I thought we were about to get a jump ball there. He dishes it off to my dude, who drains it. That sucks. Oh well, we're all right. The sprint halftime report. We're not doing too bad. We started off really well. We've been missing some shots lately, taking some bad ones, but that's all right. We can afford him. All right, coming in 457 left in the third quarter. Oh wow, we're down by two. We got to step this up here. Bam, 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 a lot of well, he shut me up. Take his third and fourth free throw shots at the game right here. Well, it seems like they're having a Look at the Wizards trying to jock the magic with the uh, the little kind of a day. Tinkerbell sound effect after the free throws. That is no good. Pistons trail by three. Doesn't sound nearly as good either. Looking at who they've got. Ooh. Josh Smith and I Greg thought he was going to take that to the hoop. Mr. Clutch I see you, Greg. Billups, and it's Harrelson in at the pivot spot. I see you, Greg. How was that a bad call for pass? All back to Seraphin, not the fudge, just the dude. Presence, this game is crazy. Nice, soft <laughs> it says I got a bad call for pass, even though he did pass it to me. I was wide open, got an easy shot. Developing, but there's a lot to like about this young Oop. big man. Now let's send it to Doris from the sideline. Thanks, guys. Mr. Clutch in their last game against the Magic Boy was he tremendous. He had 37 points, and he got there with his usual way. Just an impressive barrage of threes. <laughs> what a show it was as he put up some really amazing numbers when it was all said and done. An impressive Even barrage of threes. Performance, Kevin. Appreciate it, Doris. Thanks. Well, we, we haven't had that many in this game, have we? Have a lot of great games, but that that Clark was something special. Kevin, it really was. I mean, they threw everything but the kitchen sink at him, and nothing slowed him down. But let's just say he was really good. Hit him with a spin move. Oh, Smith. look at that! Opening up the paint for Smith to Smith's take a nice dish and an easy point. To continue to put pressure on the defense. Easy basket. Inside. That's what's really working for them. 
And when you're doing the job, they are Ooh, look inside. At, it takes pressure. Is nobody guarding him, or what's going on here? He well, just certainly didn't have much of a lackadaisically the drove that to the basket and worked out. Well, that's important because this game, I think, is going to be decided by who controls the paint in crunch time. Caldwell Pope kicks to Mark. Oh, fudge. Damn it. I was trying to get a quick pass in there. Here's Temple. Right now averaging Ooh. five points a game. An easy Yikes. Oh, they're up by four. Holy shit, I didn't realize. I didn't realize what was going on here. Baseline drive. Their high energy defensive effort has paid off for them, guys. Nice. Good job, Smith. Over the course of the ball game. You also Josh, you watch look how well they've defended the rim as they've challenged virtually All right, here we go. We only got 12 points, man. What is this? From beyond the arc since coming out of the break. The pass to Webster. Webster off a pick from zero. Oh. And there's a whistle that goes on Mr. Clutch. That's his first foul of the game. Wow, I took the foul for that. That's bogus. Well, some really terrific numbers for Seraphim. 10 points and two rejections. You know, he's been so good at both ends of the nice. floor, guys, but what's impressed me the most Thank is you for his missing. offensive performance. I don't know, Steve. I think the work he's done defensively has been pretty impressive, too. Can't leave me open. Corner, Martin, that's good. Martin's got five points now. Social media challenge? Oh, Can't shit, I forgot we had that. Okay, thank God I decided to take that shot. Have gone five of nine on field goal attempts since halftime. Pass it over here. And Temple Ooh. kicks to Seraphim. He takes the turnaround J. Woo. Count that one. Okay, I see you, bro. Seraphim's got 13 points. And at the offensive end, oh, what the heck's going on? As much as they could have hoped for today. Well, it was an ugly Risky start pass. to the season for the Wizards. Tried to revamp by trading. Look at that. Good ball movement. Out of the gate, times were tough as they lost their first 12. Eventually got things turned around and were more dangerous. Orchestrating the offense today, baby. I'm not taking all those crazy threes and I'm just dishing it off. We got five assists already. Time called here. The Wizards decide to talk it over. And during the timeout, both coaches getting a chance here to review the strategy at this point of the game along with the discussions. Also some rehydration. Right, here we go. Gatorade. Everyone trying to bring their top game here tonight. Yeah, that's why you see the trainers going around to every player. Woo! Making nice. sure they're hydrated. They're getting enough to drink during the game. So important to hydrate yourself and keep yourself strong. And All right, we'll reset, guys. Unfortunately, the, uh... It's down the stretch. Pass to Harrelson. They get a oh, hand on it. shit. I want the ball. Damn it. Unfortunately, the fast break Here's there didn't work out. Tried to reset, didn't, Here's Porter. didn't work. Ooh, he nails that. Okay, 65-67. The difference for the Wizards after Wall came back, as you said, Clark, was just day and night. They were so much more energized and seemed to relish the role of playing the spoiler for a lot of teams, Steve, down the stretch. Yeah, they looked like a Harrelson, you're making me nervous out there, man. That's the, the challenge this season as we watch this club. Oh, uh, damn it. Give the ball back to me. I'm trying to run a give and go here, bro. Ooh, John Wall throwing it down. Oh, I love it. Kia Slam Cam. Ooh. That's going to be us. No worries. Guys, this is just too close of a game to be giving the ball up like that and then failing to get back in transition. Oh, that was a great angle. Come on. Oh, damn it. No right. slowing him down. Just incredible numbers for Martin. 15 points, and he's bringing three three-point bombs so far. I'll tell you what, he should not hesitate to keep firing from out there. Oh, well, thank he's you. Got the touch tonight. We, we got the touch tonight. We got the touch tonight, baby. We got the touch every now. I don't know what y'all talking One of about. The problems for the Pistons last season was they always. We do need to, to start taking some more shots, so otherwise you're going to be in trouble. Just sustain the kind of intensity and focus Ooh. needed to win consistently. That was a big part of why they had such Come a. Come on, tough nine game. seconds. Porter passes the wall. Four on the clock. Stolen! Let's go. Come on, Stucky. Hell yes, Stucky. I love you, bro. You're the man. I want to take your starting spot. I want to take somebody else. Let me take Chauncey Billups. I don't like him. Washington's gone three of seven tonight from three-point territory. Let's go. And now Martin pushing it up. Can we slam this? Ah! Woo! We almost missed the layup. Martin's got nine points here in the second half. That is up-tempo basketball at its best. So much easier to operate in the open court when a steal triggers the break. Yeah, it really does. All right, seven seconds. Go better. When you can get out and run and get easy opportunities, then everybody gains confidence. Here we go. 
Got it off in time. Shit. Would have counted had it gone in. Tie game. Ah, we definitely would have knocked that one down if he wouldn't have blocked it. That's all right. Whatever. I wish you could call for a pick and roll before you get over half court. You can't call it until you're over the half court line. So, like, I can't have somebody there ready for the pick, you know? Okay, you gotta be smart out there with your shot. I don't wanna see, I don't wanna see you take another bad shot for the rest of this quarter. That's no problem, coach. I don't take any bad shots. Every shot I take is a good shot, because I make them all. All fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset the lineups courtesy of Gatorade for the fourth quarter. Let's go! So, on the four for Washington. Al Harrington is out there with Gortat. Woo! And it's Trevor Ariza. And it's Wall. And it's Stolen nice. from Wow. We're already to an A minus. We have a and whole quarter left to go. And we're also probably going to play the pistol. entire quarter. Boy, Damn, son. We're about to get an A plus this game, I think. All the steals we've seen. Really a result of that aggressiveness. Another fact here. Shooting foul. Looked like he had his feet turtle. stuck down there. Well, Trevor Ariza is not really a great offensive player. I mean, but defensively now, that's a different story. Wow, that's bogus. Now, Trevor Ariza is not really a great offensive like player. I like the intensity he plays with. This is a guy that only played one year of college basketball. He's made a nice career for himself in the NBA. And for Ariza, you remember that postseason with the Lakers, Steve, back in 2009? Got him. Whoa! How did we not make that? Another steal. Let's go. I think he's still a player who's best suited rebounding, defending, being a hustle guy, an energy player. And ah, shots, there it is. It's just kind of gravy. But We've got really, so many steals in this game. Good description. How many steals do we have? Pass to Rice. Ooh. And there's the whistle. Fouled hard on the shot. He'll go to the line. It's going to be on Josh Smith. Points in the paint for the Wizards, really a problem area last year. This has been a good ass game for us. We're hot on defense, we're hot on offense, we're hot on everything. Maybe a full year of having John Wall healthy will help that because he creates easy scoring opportunities. I guess we're not hot on offense. Making a switch here. Harrelson's checked in. Oh, I should have hit you, Greg. I'm sorry. Kicks it to the fudge. And here we go, Washington fans. Woo! John Wall throwing it down. All right, 75 to 75. We're being done with the ball now. Ooh, I could have hit Greg again right there. Nice. Okay. Cool. Intensity as the game itself starts to get a little more tight. There we go. As for the Wizards, as you Ooh, I thought we were about to get another steal. Team in the NBA when it came to points in the paint. But they just couldn't get much going from the big. All right, tie game again. And some of that was the injury to John Wall early because he's the one who has to set the table for those guys. But uh, look, this is a team that uh, has made some improvements. They're gaining some momentum. They've got some good young talent. I think that area. The Woo! Behind the back. Oh, my goodness. That was just beautiful. I mean, elementary. Used to that was around. nasty. Yeah, very nice set play for it. Well, that's using your head and using your body. The feet now to Gorton. Oh shit. By Craig Monroe. One of that re. Monroe Here we go, baby. Six rebounds now in the Let's game. get something going on the offensive There's side of things. Screen. Martin for three. Got him. Martin's, Martin's got seven points here in this quarter. He's putting on a commanding performance here. He's hit two three pointers in each half now. Phillips against Wall. What do you got, John? You better not come over here. <laughs> I don't blame you. How was that a bad steal attempt? Got that re. Let's go. What do we got, guys? Who's cutting? Now, Mark. Nice. Good drive. And now a seven-point Detroit lead. Well, we've seen that more than a few times. An easy bucket in the lane. Yeah, the interior defense simply Oops, has been shit. lifeless. And we're about three and a half minutes into... John Wall is ball-hogging it up. Got myself another game. rebound. Let's go. Yeah, Get out to Stucky. Right Ooh. Feast on those wide open Yikes. To end the run. Goes back up. And Damn it. That one's good by Gortat. And at this stage of the game, that offensive rebound. That was my Gortat fault, bros. Is enormous. I mean, that feels like a four point swing. Martin from outside. Oh! Oh, Harrington grabs the board. Shit. Harrington's got four rebounds now tonight. I just feel like taking over, over right now, you know? Martin picking him up. 
What do you got, John? Let's go, bro. Ooh. Ooh. Trying to go for that steal. Harrington can't get that one to fall. Pistons leading by five. Stucky trades inside. It was open. Billups from outside. Billups puts it up and drains it nice. All right, we got a solid lead here. I think we pretty much uh, pretty much uh, stuck the dagger in the heart here. All day and it's begun to take its toll. Harrington with a screen on Billups. Reza passes to Rice. Ooh, good move. Out left of the wing. Shot clock at six. Here's Gortat. Wow. That was some amazing ball movement by that team. They had us all over the floor. The Pistons have gone seven and nine from the field down the stretch here in the fourth quarter. Terrific shooting. Martin dishes to Monroe. Oh, Monroe! I was so wide open. It's not even funny. Uh oh, shit, dude. 87-83. They're starting. What are they on? Like a six-zero run? been on the money with his game. Doris Burke has an update for us. Doris? Yes, during that break, Coach Maury's cheeks had some words for his team. Breaking no runs wide open. With his team struggling from three-point territory, he told them to start looking for more high Way to draw the foul. Inside the paint. We're forcing Ooh. too many threes, he said. Way too early there. I felt that one. And work it inside. Slightly early again, what the fudge? How do we miss both of those? Is it because we were tired or because it's like an important part today? They have been. I didn't expect that result when he stepped up there. What the fuck, dude? Martin kicks to Smith. Back to Martin. But three. Shit. I'm forcing it now. I'm feeling bad because I missed both those free throws. I want to make up for it. Okay, here. Slow it down. We got a rebound. Ooh, all those guys were covered. Into Smith. Into Josh. Shoots from eight. Oh! I was trying to box out, but it bounced poorly. Unreal, man. Okay, we we had a solid lead, and we have now blown that. Oh my God! Oh my goodness! Four turnovers from Trevor. Who do we have? Okay, we're on wall. We're on wall. Whoa! they've gone on this run, and ball movement has been a big key. Yeah, they have the defense on the run right now. Oh my god, okay, here we go. We gotta step up. We gotta step up. Give me the ball. Catch up with Doris from the sideline. Hey guys, I was able to hear what Maury's cheeks was telling you Shit. during the break. That was supposed to be for Josh. Running the offense through Martin. Coach was obviously looking for big things from him in this game and is still hoping that takes shape very Come on. quickly. His second message was centered on getting back quickly on defense. Over the back foul! No! Oh my god, we have been falling apart. We have been falling apart, dude. Absolutely falling apart. Okay, we need to step it up. Left in the game. Wall dishes to Gortat. And the pass to Rice. Feeds it to Wall. From deep. Shit. Holy crap, dude. This is 110% our fault if we don't win. I've been playing like an idiot. Outside, Martin. Ooh, he was wide open. I wish I could have dished it to him. Outside, Martin. There's a good screen. The dish to Harrelson. Put it up there, Harrelson. Yes. And he has brought them to All right, down by two. Forty-nine point eight left. That is the shot of the game. Well, he's got the guts and courage to take it, and the skill to make it. The guts and courage to take it, and the skill to make it. I like that. Outside, wall. Pass to Rice. He dishes it to Harrington. No. No. Yes. Okay. Boy, from my angle, it looked like it was in the bottom of the net. Look good from here. Yeah. Let's go. Woo! That shot sucked the life out of the whole build. That was a big. Hell yes. Yeah, that was a gut punch. Shut him up, baby. T. Martin is here to play. Gortat. Uh oh. 20.3 seconds. Down by one. Defensive stop. It sealed the deal.
I want the ball in my hands, man. Get down to Harrelson. Here's Harrelson. Back to Martin. Oof. Baseline drive all day. Dishes Shit. To no! Turnover! And that's out of Pistons ball. 3.5 seconds. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Long range from the inbound. Oh, that shot at a Really? Who was that? Billups? Was that Billups that had the ball there? I was wide open, running around, calling for the inbound. Whoever inbounded it didn't give it to me. He gave it to Billups. I was still calling for the ball, and Billups didn't pass, and he throws it up from half court. That's fucking amazing. Good job, Chauncey. You're an idiot. You, I'm not even going to take responsibility for the loss of that game. Because, yes, I could have played better towards the end there. We did miss a couple of shots. We had a couple of turnovers. But you are a 